Welcome to another Spread Cheetahs video guide. You can find written instructions for these steps on the Spread Cheetahs website. In this video, we'll see how to delete a page in Excel. Excel is a spreadsheet application in which the workspace is laid out in the forms of, uh, form of rows and columns. So unlike a word processing application where the workspace is in the form of pages, I will not know how the pages are going to look if I take a printout of the worksheet. So before printing a worksheet, it is a good idea always to look at the uh, page break or the print preview to see how the pages are going to be laid out before you send it to the printer. If not, when you're printing the pages, there could be a lot of um, spillover. The data will not be properly aligned on the pages and there's a lot of wastage. So in this example, we're going to see I have some data here. Now, before printing it, I'm going to take a look at the page uh, break preview or the print preview. So under the view menu, I'll go to page break preview. And now I see that the data is arranged in two pages, but I also have an empty page here. So I want to delete this page. Of course, when you're sending it to the printout, uh, to the printer, it may not matter because this will come as a blank page. But if you have created headers and footers for your uh, pages, then unnecessarily this page will get printed with the header and the footer. So it is better to delete this page. To do this, all I need to do is to select the blue border at the extreme right of the, on the right uh, side of the page and drag it towards the, towards page two and release. And this deletes the page. So now when I need to print out, I will get only two pages. So that being said, I can return back to the normal view. This is how to delete a page in Excel. Please read the appended article for further guidance. 